At the Los Alamos Plutonium Processing Facility, workers chemically separated the element by dissolving and mixing in large tanks. It was in one of these very tanks where Cecil Kelly received this nova of energy in his head. Kelly found himself on his back on the floor of the facility. All Cecil could say was, I'm burning up. At 6 a.m. on New Year's Day, 1959, Dr. Clarence Lushbaugh began an autopsy. More than just dissecting a body, what he was about to do would kick off a series of semi-secret experiments, draw comparisons in the media to the sci-fi trope of body snatchers. Lushbaugh did not ask anyone for permission before removing eight pounds of muscle, bone, soft tissue, brain, and spinal cord. He placed the samples in several wide mouth mayonnaise jars and transported them back to his lab. It was decided to collect tissue samples from other facility staff like Kelly and from the general public as a control. This is the true story of the body snatchers of Los Alamos.